Hey guys, it's editing Eric here. Uh, no, this time I am not telling you how bad my sub ratio is. I'm here to tell you that everything I say in this video is obviously a joke. I do have to do this because uh, YouTube would probably slap me with some form of strike or something stupid like that. I do truly think this movie is just pure torture. Uh, but everything related to KYS or, you know, uh, murdering people is a joke. But please enjoy. Hello, Nintendo fans. My name is Mario Master. How we doing today? I want to fucking die. This movie was suffering. Uh, <laughs> This movie was pure agony. Every fucking second was hell. Oh my god. If you're wondering what movie I'm talking about today, I'm talking about the 2022 Marmaduke remake with fucking whatever the fuck. Pete Davidson. Oh my god. Okay. Let me just go over. Okay, I just watched this movie. I have so many other things I could have done to just suffer through that. So the movie overall is an hour and a half long. Uh, that's an hour and a half of my life that I will never get back because this movie is pure fucking suffering. I do not believe I have seen a worse movie in my life. This movie is worse than DC Super Pets. And I hated that movie. Now, there are... There's one. One single funny bit in this entire movie. And I believe it was intentional... And it's the bit where a kid gets nailed by a car. Here it is. Right here. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> he just gets fucking nailed. <laughs> and he gets nailed again. I'm playing it. Mm, there it is. Fucking beautiful. Kid gets nailed by a car. That's the only part that I actually liked. That's the only part that made me laugh. And I want to fucking kill myself. This movie was so bad. Ah, I want to blow up the earth. I want to kill 17 people. Also, by the way, one of the great things about this movie, it fucking warns you. This movie is supposed to be for kids. And it tells you that it's... So, like, usually when you look at, you know, a Netflix movie, it gives you, like, oh, yeah, this is, like, Horror, uh, science, sci-fi, family, whatever, right? Like, with Mitchells vs. Machines, it's like funny, uh, family-friendly, like that kind of stuff, right? The only thing, the only thing that Marmaduke has is just fear. Here it is. It's real. I'll okay, I'm going to show you what I mean. First off, we're actually going to put... I'm gonna put up an actual good dog movie, Beethoven. Really good. Okay, you. We look over. Look at this family movies, kid friendly movies, whatever. Blah blah blah. Right. But we go over to Marmaduke. I wasn't kidding. It just says fear. Yes, you should have fear. I'll show you the picture of it right here. It's just fear. I, I, <laughs> I want to die. <coughs> there is legit zero good things about this movie. The animation is ass. It is the worst thing I have seen to date. It has to be one of the worst movies I have ever seen in 20... Like, this movie was made in 2022. This is the worst movie that has ever come from 2022. 
And it was... It's the worst movie fucking now. God damn it. Even the Star Wars remakes weren't this bad. Because at least I could sit through those. But I still had to scream at the fucking TV. This movie, I had to be... I was just crying uh, because of the pain. The animation is ass. The voice acting is ass. Like, legit, Pete Davidson voices Marmaduke. He could not sound less like he gives a fuck. Like, legit, he starts out of... He starts the movie, like, narrating. It looks like he is just phoned it... It just sounds like he has phoned it in. He could not give two less shits about what the fuck he's producing. Also, my lord and savior, fucking J.K. Simmons, fucking Omni-Man... They dragged Omni-Man into the movie, and it makes me mad. I get that actors need a paycheck now and then, but there are better ways. J.K. Simmons, no. Uh, they I don't even know how they dragged Omni-Man. I, I truly do not know how they dragged fucking J.K. Simmons into this. Pete Davidson, once again, I don't, I, I've never really liked Pete Davidson. I don't think he's funny. I don't think anyone really thinks he's funny. I don't even know how he got popular. I think he just did a Kardashian and people were like, ooh. He's not even that funny. He's not even that good of an actor, in my opinion. He just kind of sucks. Like, he's not even, like, I didn't even like him in The Rookie. And I like The Rookie. Um... Overall, movie suck. Like the Pete Davidson, not a good actor, not a good choice. Right off the bat, no. J.K. Simmons, how in the fuck did they drag you into this? There's a, a there's a fart joke, ha <laughs> ha, funny, ha <laughs> ha, funny, funny joke, fart, 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 ha <laughs> <laughs> laugh, fart, fart joke, ha 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 ha. Oh my god, this movie was true in bridal pain. It doesn't help, okay? That number one. The lip sync is horrible. You can tell this movie was made in a third world country because not only are all the uh all like the studios, you know, are from third world Chinese companies, the lip sync the lip sync is off to a momentous degree. I mean like it's worse than anime sometimes. Like it it's just so bad like it there's no effort there's no there's nothing it's just hell this movie is fucking pain this is what they are going to use for torture to get information from criminals this is, they're going to torture people with this movie I, uh, <laughs> I don't think anyone liked this movie. Here's like the Rotten Tomatoes rating, if I can find it. I'm pretty sure it's just zero. This movie was so bad. It's amazing that they made, that like anyone knew about it. Now, the 2017 Marmaduke isn't great either. I'm not saying that movie is better. But. My god. I don't even know if that movie was made in 2017. I'm just going to say it was. Here's the real date. Whatever. Fuck you. But compared to this. To this Marmaduke. That movie is a godsend. God tier. Best thing I've ever seen in my fucking life. Ah. Uh... And I, I know, I know it might seem like I am overreacting. I can guarantee you I am underreacting. Like, when I say this movie is worse than DC Super Pets, I truly mean this movie is worse than DC Super Pets. And that movie sucked balls. That movie was so fucking bad. I just don't understand how 
the fuck anyone, and I do mean anyone, would enjoy Marmaduke 2022. If you want to endure an hour and a half of just pure ass animation, ass voice acting, and overall, you're going to want to shoot your fucking brains out experience, fucking be my guest. It's available on Netflix. But overall, I give this movie a negative 1 billion out of 10. By far, Marmaduke is the worst of the worst movies I have ever seen. Because it's not bad good. I like bad good Like, okay. It's not like it's so bad it's good. Like, The Room or Killer Clowns from Outer Space or, you know, like those movies. Those, like, B tier movies where it's so bad it's good, you know? Like, kind of like the B movie. The B movie is, like, it's not bad. The, I like the B movie. The B movie is a god tier movie. I just, you know, some people say it's bad, but it's so bad, it's, it's so bad, it's good, you know? It's kind of like that. Plus, I love Jerry Seinfeld as a B. But anyway, like, this isn't even, like, it's so bad, it's good. It's just fucking bad. Like I said, that one part out of the entire movie where a kid just gets fucking nailed by a car, <coughs> I'm dying, is the only fucking good part about the movie. Uh, I have a headache. I want to die. Once again, if you want to watch this movie, <coughs> oh, fucking Christ. <coughs> if you want to watch this movie and suffer like I did, be my guest. It is on Netflix, but I can guarantee you, you will want to die just like me. Ah! Uh, I, 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 I don't know. That is an hour and a half that I will never, ever in a million years get back. I have a blistering headache and I want to die. Go watch it. Don't do it. Do it. I fucking dare you. Do it. Do it. (laughs) Oh, it's so bad, dude. It's so fucking bad. And it's not so good. It's bad. It's just Bad. Uh, anyway, that's it. I'm gonna go fucking scream and want to die like I already don't. Uh, thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Subscribe because I suffered. Please. Also, don't forget to check out. Twitter, Discord, Patreon, all in the description below. Patreon's one dollar a month. I do extra videos. Um, there's a full unedited video up there right now, so you guys can watch that. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah, bye, peace, bye. God, I want to die. <laughs>